So we get into a question about whether or not immigrants have increased crime in certain areas or certain cities in the United States. And it's a very interesting question. Um, I'd say probably both sides of the issue have their own statistics to throw at us. And it's very difficult to decipher those statistics, especially because statistics can always be skewed uh, depending on what side you're sitting on. And anybody who's studied those um, courses understands that. So let's look at this from a common sense approach and whether or not immigrants, and I'd say legal or illegal, increase crime. Well, the first thing we need to know in order to know that is what's the rate of crime among immigrants themselves? And since we don't really have a good number for them, and again, that's statistics, we can say with some certainty that in general, people in the United States, legal, illegal, or citizens, there's a small amount of people who cause problems and they commit crimes. And the majority of people here are law-abiding citizens. You would also have to look at the broader question, which would be, why did they come here and why are they here? And I think if you can answer that question, um, then I think you'd be able to sparse out or s segment a lot of these, um, separate a lot of these people from each other. So you have the people that are here for economic purposes to feed their families and to get a better life, then these people are probably not going to be committing crimes. And you got these other people here who are just, they're lost causes, and they're probably going to be committing crimes. Um, so the increase of criminals because of immigration I think is a very difficult question and I don't think it can be lumped into a huge segment.